Hi folks, it's John from LastChanceRStore.com. I'd like to share with you a brief update. Um, we're looking at the 1969 Ford Mustang convertible. Um, the, this project's been on hold for a little while. We're waiting for some back order parts uh, before we continue with the reassembly. And there's lots going on kind of behind the scenes. So much earlier on, we shared with you where we, we purchased for our client this abandoned project. So it's a 69 uh, Mustang convertible. Um, it was originally a 302 car automatic transmission. We are giving it a little bit new life and, and making quite a few enhancements to it. It was a, a drum brake, non-power brake car, and we have this nice disc brake conversion kit as one of the many upgrades we're going to be doing. So uh, we basically, it's been on back order for a little while. It just arrived and I just laid everything out because uh, we wanted to make sure that we have all of the components that we need to do the, uh, the disc brake uh, conversion install. So we have, it's a really nice kit. It's from a company called CSRP. Uh, we really like the quality of it. It comes with virtually everything you're going to need. So we have our, our backing plates for, uh, to go behind the rotors. We have uh, the two brackets here that are powder coated with the proper threads that we need uh, for mounting. So we have the mounts, uh, we have the, the, uh, the splash pans in behind. We have an exceptional, we upgraded uh, these rotors to a vented. You'll see there's large vents uh, in the hub. We have vents in the side, which I can just lift it up here. So these are our beautiful heavy duty uh, disc brake rotor. You can see we have the cooling grooves machined in. We have the vents here uh, and also the large vents in the hub. So this is a, a really nice quality uh, piece that uh, we upgraded as part of this package. You can see we have our, our brake booster with our master cylinder. We have the little fitting for vacuum. Uh, this one is set up for a uh, manual transmission. They also have kits available uh, for the automatic. Um, so we've got the, uh, the brace, the pin, everything we need that's going to attach to the firewall. And then we have our four piston calipers. We have the upgraded braided uh, lines, flex lines for the front, instead of going with the rubber lines, we have the stainless uh, metal lines. We have upgraded um, disc brake pads. You can see we have our nice proportioning valve to adjust the pressure to the rear brakes. And then we have all of our lines and clips and hardware. And they even uh, pre-make the lines for us uh, for the calipers. And then we have the other lines, once again, upgraded to the stainless um, braided line, which we really like. If there's an option to do that, we like to upgrade to the higher quality. Uh, and then same thing with our bearings, our inner and outer bearings uh, with the races. They're the highest quality you can get. Uh, and then same thing with our seals, all of our hardware. And because it was a... Uh, we got the pedal assembly, so we've made a lot of purchases to get to this stage to get ready for the pre-assembly uh, where we're going to dry fit everything in. So we're changing this 69 Mustang convertible from a, um, an 8-cylinder uh, automatic to, um, to a larger 8-cylinder. It's going to be a 351, um, and it's bored 60 over. Uh, it's going to have a little more attitude. Um, the transmission is going to be upgraded. It's going to be a T5, so an upgraded five-speed manual transmission. Um, and then we got a, um, the uh, pedal assembly uh, we purchased for a manual um, so that we have this component that's important that has to go along with it. So this pedal, being disc brake conversion, um, is part of this kit and it's an important piece because we have to make sure with all the bushings and levers that everything fits the original uh, piece that we purchased from a, a vehicle uh, that was originally a, a manual Mustang. So these are all the nice components um, to convert the front drum brakes non-power to a power disc brake uh, conversion kit. We have all of our components here. So in an upcoming video we'll share with you um, the front end. We've got lots of components and they're all brand new for the front. So we'll be doing um, new upper and lower control arms, all new bushings, new coil springs, new KYB shocks. So everything in the front will be upgraded and in new condition. And then we'll reassemble that front section. Uh, we just have the engine almost ready at the machine shop. 
uh, because they're doing the machining for us and then we're going to do all the reassembly of the engine. Uh, so as this uh, 69 Mustang convertible build continues, we'll share with you a little updates as it comes along. So I thank you for watching. I'm John from LastChanceAutoRestore.com.